The heart is a muscle, and any muscle requires a blood supply to function. The heart is supplied by two main blood vessels, the left coronary artery and the right coronary artery. The left will further divide into two large branches, the left anterior descending artery, that is also known as the LAD, and the left circumflex artery. Each of these vessels will supply a part of the heart, and in combination these three vessels supply the whole of the heart. When any of these vessels is occluded, the territory supplied by that vessel no longer receives the oxygen it needs, and the cells within that territory will suffocate, and if the occlusion persists, these cells will eventually die. When the cells die, they are no longer able to contribute to the pumping ability of the heart, and the heart function will decline. It is therefore logical to say that the single most important factor in terms of prognosis from a heart attack is the size of the affected territory. The larger the territory that dies, the weaker the heart gets.